What's up guys? Welcome to a brand new vlog. A little different than my normal content because today is extra especial. Taylor and I are in Des Moines, Iowa, which feels like it should be pronounced Des Moines. It's like where are the S is going, but super exciting stuff. You see this suitcase right here? You see this suitcase right here? They are not filled with clothes, but just like my backpack, they are filled with sour strips bites because we are going to a business expo to try to get a bunch of store owners for a new grocery chain to take on the new Sour Strips Bites. I've done this before at HEB where I would go in and present myself and talk to all the managers. This expo, all the managers of this grocery chain, it's called High V. it's in the Midwest. It's super popular, super cool, we're very excited. All the managers are gonna be here and we have to convince them that they need Sour Strips Bites in their stores. Now I've been to expos before, I've been in expo mode the world has never seen Expo Sales Max mode. <laughs> they're in for a treat. Or they're gonna be very annoyed. I don't know, either way, it's gonna be a great time. What do you think? Welcome to the Sour Strips HQ. Now, let me walk you through this bad boy and, and uh, you can experience what all these buyers are gonna experience. So they're gonna walk up and first go, why is the sign all stretched out, sir? And I'm gonna go, well, that's because it's an eight foot table and we have a six foot sign, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, what is Sour Strips? Well, Sour Strips is the most new and exciting sour candy brand that you have ever had in your life. Do you like this sign? You like the wrinkles? There's no plugs anywhere. So, you know, it is what it is as well. What are these? Well, so these are their brand new Sour Strips Bites. This is revolutionary stuff in the candy world. Why? Because it's actually good sour candy. Now, if you would like a sample, sir, ma'am, we have these little cups. Oh, what, what are those? Are those custom branded little cups? Oh my gosh, you wanna put some margarita in there? I'm gonna pour you some of these. Then they're gonna go, wow, that is the best sour candy I've ever had in my life. And I go, well, hey, for your store, would you like some sour candy that doesn't suck? Well, why don't you fill out some forms right here? We'll put you down for 100,000 cases. And then what? You have a whole bunch of friends at a whole bunch of different other stores and stuff. Here's my business card with business information on it. Look at that, okay? If you sign up right now, sir or ma'am, you're gonna get a discount on your first order. Bam, wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. It's gonna be insane, it's gonna be crazy, or no one's gonna come to our booth. I'm stressed. We are literally next to like Mars Wrigley. We're next to Airheads, Smart Suites, Haribo's, right down this. We're with the big dogs. The Chun dogs are with the big dogs. <laughs> Didn't really get any footage, but let me tell. How 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 was it for you? Was it good for you? It was really good. It the was time fun. flew by. Yeah, it flew. I didn't feel like we were gonna be here that long. I want to first of all, what a freaking trooper partner to do this with me because this is, I find it very very exciting. But uh, it's it's I mean, it's a business trade show. But yeah. it was. I love the business. Yeah, and we we sold. 855 of these at today's show, which is massive, okay? Which is huge. I'm so excited for this to go into high V stores um, in like two, basically like two, within two weeks of this video going up, we're gonna be in high V, which is a, 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 a major retailer in the Midwest, and um, I'm just over the moon. I mean, it's, the feedback on the product. Everyone loved it. Oh my gosh, the feedback was amazing. Everyone was saying like just comparing us to other brands, which I'm not gonna say what they said out here But it was it was good for sour strips and um, I'm proud of you. I'm I'm thank I'm thank for doing this with me Of course. And uh, I, I don't even know what to say. It was it was a cool experience and um, I had like three people that followed the channel one guy was wearing a freaking Everford button-down It works at IV and had a backpack and had a freaking Everford backpack this was amazing, really cool experience, and um, I'm excited to keep growing the, the brand and 
This is the first of many. This is the, this is the first of many. Like, y'all remember when we were like stocking the shelves at HEB and I was going in to talk with the managers? This is essentially like that. And uh, I love being so hands-on. I love, I love shaking babies and kissing hands. And uh, I'm just through the roof. I'm over the moon. Oh, 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 Taylor, oh, this video is not sponsored, but it's coming. Don't worry. Um, very. Is that funny? <laughs> you thought I was gonna do it. Um, by the way, Iowa. This is our first time here, and yesterday we went into a sushi place, which someone else said you ordered sushi in Iowa. I don't know, but I I was wearing a T-shirt, a Zara T-shirt in jeans. And Taylor's had a, you know, she looked amazing, but it was a very casual outfit. They, we walked in, and the people at the sushi place basically were like, damn, y'all dressed up. You know, This is Iowa. You don't yeah. have to. I was like, I'm wearing a t shirt. <laughs> By the way, you want to see some new candy? I know, you know, we don't promote other candy, but Airheads is coming out with uh, sour Airheads. Look at this one lemon berry. Lemon berry. Lemon berry? Bam! They thought we were overdressed in a t-shirt. Wait till they get a check out of Miami-Dade County, Maxi Poo. Look how beautiful she looks. Thank you, I don't feel pretty, but thank you. <laughs> it, uh, it's, it's only like 5.45, we're going in for dinner because the show was actually like eight hours long and we've had about 15 calories this entire day. So we're gonna have a nice little meal. And you know what? Hey, commentary Maxi Poo, hit him with a voiceover. Well, hello there, boys and girls. <clears throat> Oh, sorry, I don't know what that was. So tonight we went to this nice steakhouse called 801 Chop House, and would you just look at the vibes? I mean, come on. This bull right here represents grabbing life by the horns, which is actually how I handle my business. It, it's a metaphor. And then we got ourselves some cocktails. Mine was called a strawberry slammer, which is pretty funny and ironic because that's actually what they used to call me in prison. Then we split a nice Caesar salad and a French onion soup, or I guess if you're watching this in France, it would just be an onion soup. For the main course, Miss Taylor had scallops and French fries, Girl dinner, and your boy got 12 ounces of sex, the filet mignon. Overall, solid eight out of 10, but you gotta tell me, is this steak medium? I ordered medium, but it looks pretty rare. I don't know. And now, let's get back to the vlog. We're back, baby. Isn't this channel insane? It's like, you get some new content that you've never seen before going to Iowa, and then, Halfway through the video, you come back to the exact same content I've been filming for like 10 years. It's, it's, it's revolutionary stuff on this channel. Uh, David and Julia are in town, and they're hosting like an event today at Alpha Land. So let's go meet up with them. But first, uh, we got to pick something up. Candy. It, it, it's always candy. Whenever we need to pick up something, it's candy. Whenever someone's having an event, candy is going to be there. Whenever any of my friends do anything, I go, hey, let me give all your people free candy. I have been giving out sour strips at scale since day one. We, uh, we're actually going to New York uh, for the Gymshark Lift event in the week after, the, the week after my birthday, the week, the, September like 15th or something, and we're going to be giving out like 10,000 bags of candy. Here's a business tip. If you can afford it, the best marketing spend is giving away free candy, not little sample biatch sizes, full ass bags. So I'm gonna grab like 50 of these. Wait a second, I just, I just remembered something. I just remembered something, come here, come here, come here. I have two boxes that I found of Everford backpacks. I thought I only reserved like one or two uh, in case like when I did the final sale for these, uh, but I found two boxes. I have a box of the tan backpack and I have a box of the black and brown backpack. And maybe I have like one or two more of the all black, but there's probably like, 15 of each. So I'm gonna put these up. I'm gonna make a special link down in the description. If you want the, the final relic of Everford, you want the sickest backpack ever, and you're in the United States, I ran into a whole bunch of issues and I tried shipping overseas and it came back and it was it was terrible. So United States only, normally 150. I launched these for sale for 100 a couple weeks ago. So I don't wanna make those people pissed off. That 115 bucks, okay? Normally 150, 115 bucks, get a final, Relic of Everford, get them before they're gone. First link down in the description. Once they're gone, they're literally gone. And how about this? I'll throw in a two free bags of bites. If you get a backpack, you get two free bags of bites as well. Free candy if you buy a backpack. You don't have to buy a backpack. But if you want a backpack, you can get a backpack. And you get some free candy. 
It's basically like you're buying two bags of candy for 115 bucks. That sounds like a great deal. Oh yeah, right. what's up guys? What's up bro? What's going on bro? Welcome to the Beast Nation first ever meetup. What's uh, tell people what's happening. So we got, of my Beast Nation tribe, we have a, a competition. Your tribe? I like that. Yeah, my tribe. We're, beast, the, we're, we're tribe guys. The potato tribe, the beast tribe. We may have to have a, a beast versus potato event one day. It's like a meetup for the tribe. We're doing competitions, picking some winners and shit. And Max is going to be a celebrity competitor coming in next. He talks about fasties all the time. Are we going to race? I wasn't planning on doing this one, but if you want to challenge me as part of this, I'll step up. David talks a lot of shit. Who do you think is faster? This guy or this guy? This guy. Hey! Who, who, look, look at the baby bump. Oh my, can I touch it? Yeah, go ahead. Bam. Hey, 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 off whoa, my daughter. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, guys, for this race, I got to stretch and warm up. Okay, we're almost 35 years old. My body doesn't work like it once did, so we don't want to pull a ham dog millionaire. We got this. We got this, Potato Nation, maybe. Potato Nation, maybe. David and I are gonna raw dog this. Without our shoes. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna really try my best. I really hate losing to Max. I don't wanna fight. But you are him. fat, you are fat, yeah. So we're just gonna, we're gonna run to the other side, okay? We're gonna touch the line, we're gonna run back. You almost had me, but you never had me. You never had your car. <laughs> Respect, he's the faster one. I give it up. Give it up for Max, guys. Now, when you're a top tier athlete, what do you do after a big victory? Magajitas, of course. You gotta celebrate the wins, guys. You got to celebrate the wins. Getting some fajitas with my beautiful fiance, and then we get to go see one of the most manliest movies that have ever come out. Got our sour strips. What movie, what, what, what movie is this? It ends with us. With Blake Lively, it's a book that you've read. Yeah, you bought Ex it explain, what, what, explain this movie. Just roll the trailer. Hey, Lily. You wanna do the honors? No, you go ahead. I, I need to take it in from here. Well, just hoping you'd say that, okay? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's my brother, Ryle. The first official customer? Well, you'd have to buy something to be considered a customer. Right now, you're just loitering. All right, there's a lot of people, so we're gonna have to make this quick. Overall, what do you think? Four out of 10. Oh! No! Are you kidding me? It was up, it was down, there was twists. I was laughing, crying, angry all at the same you time. You cried? Maybe. I bawled. What are you giving it? You gotta give the what number. What are you giving it? What are you giving it? What's the number? I'm kidding, the movie was ass. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, no, it's terrible. Yeah. Hey, what did you think? What did you give it? I give it an eight out of 10. Well, I thought it was like a 10. No, because oh. they, they, they missed a lot of shit. How the book was bad. Gosh darn it, I don't know. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up here this is this is in real time this happens like 12 hours before you're watching it so see you in the next vlog thank you so much for tuning in eat more sour strips ever forward peace